In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up this Canon scanner with your MacBook. Now, the first thing is go to your MacBook and open the web browser. Type in ij.start.canon. Now, look for the Canon website that is here. Select it. Click on the setup. Start here. Type in scanner model number that is LIDE300 and click go. On this page we have to click for the download button. You should be able to see the Mac OS on the top corner. If not you can select it and then click download. Open the, open the file. Double click on the setup. So this is the setup window. Click next. Start setup. Next. Select your country of residence. Agree for the terms and conditions. Now it says we have to connect our scanner with the MacBook. So let's do that. You will see at the back of the scanner, we will connect this end. So this goes here. And the other end go to your MacBook. Automatically it will show up the scanner. Now click on the next. You have an option to create a desktop icon for online manual. If you want you can create it or you can just cancel it. So installation is complete. Click exit button. Close all the windows. Now I'm going to show you how to scan. Now the first thing is to open the lid and place a page for scanning. Place the page facing downwards on the left hand side corner. Close the lid. Go to your MacBook and go to the system preferences. Select printers and scanners. In this window we have to add the scanner. So click this plus button. And you should be able to see Canon Light 300. Select it. Once it is ready, click on the Add button. And automatically it should appear in this window. So we have to look for it. So let's see, that is Canon Light 300. Now click on the Open Scanner. We can enlarge this window. So once you do it, it will start the scanning. So scan has arrived here. Now if you want to change details, for example DPI, you can go up to 2400 DPI. That's a lot. So let's do 300. Select the area you want to keep for the scanning. Select where do you want to save it. And if you want a PDF or JPEG. now. We can do multiple pages, for example, combine into single document, select it. Once we are ready, hit the scan button, click scan. So that's the page one. So it just showed us preview and now it is actually scanning and saving it. So page one is done. Now if you have a multiple pages to scan, you can go to the next page. Open the lid and remove the page. Place the second page like this. Go to the screen and click on the scan. 
so that's page 2 in the same way you can add number of pages scan is transferred and to view this scan we can go on the desktop we can close this window scan pdf that's here so both pages are available here so that's the method to do the setup of this scanner using your mac thanks for watching